Your energy is not only one of the most sacred things that you have, it's also one of the most powerful things that you possess. And I need you, you need you, to overstand this. Because when you do, you'll use it differently, you'll handle it differently, you'll guard it differently, you'll care for it correctly because you'll see its power, you'll see its value, you'll see its ability, you'll understand its virtue. I mean, when you realize your energy alone could either calm troubled waters or capsize your life's vessel, you're going to use it more wisely and more precisely, right? In fact, you'll start protecting it. You'll protect it the way that you protect your life because you'll understand that this is one of the most powerful parts of your being. This is the part of you that can stretch forth throughout the universe and come back with the tools and resources that you need to make your thoughts and meditations and, uh, and, and desires and confessions come into fruition. And when you believe you and your energy have a purpose, you won't prostitute it. You won't take it places that it doesn't need to be. You won't uh, bring people who serve no purpose around who are just going to withdraw from you in exchange for some minimal momentary gain. In fact, you become quite intentional with your energy. And that's where your power lies is your attention. I'll give you an example. Like the same way that if you got a full blood pit bull or a pit bull from a certain bloodline, you're not going to breed it with another uh, pit bull that's not full blood or not from a certain bloodline because you don't want to what? Weaken the bloodline. We apply need to apply that same understanding and train of thought to our own energy and not be willing to mix our energy with those that don't suit us, those who um, don't uphold or increase our value. I mean, that's, that's, that's so important. And it could be a family member. It could be a friend. Especially it could be a lover because sex is, is less of a physical act and more of a spiritual ritual where energies are being transferred anyway. That's for a whole nother video that we'll get into that another time. But, I mean, we all know, if not, it was our, ourselves who broke up with someone and then life, like, almost instantly seemed to change. And new doors started opening and opportunities started coming your way and different things like that. The world ain't changed. Your energy changed. The, and the negative energy that was attached to you is no longer there. So now yours can go forth and do what it needs to do the way that it is supposed to do it. But one thing about it and two things for sure, your energy don't lie and the universe don't lie. So you should get to know them both. Be blessed. I'll talk to y'all soon.